Hello everyone, my name is Diva. I'm a reseller on Poshmark, Mercari, eBay, and sometimes Amazon. Today I have a 50 pound um, thread up denim box for you, so check it out. Okay, I decided to get one again. Um, I just really love selling jeans. I've been selling a whole bunch of jeans and pants and it's just it's exciting to me and plus it was all they had available at the time and i'm trying to buy inventory every single week to try to flood my store because i am working on volume right now i'm getting ready for any potential high sales that i might get so yeah <laughs> anyway right off the top here um i have found it is a made well jean very exciting when I opened this box, I saw the M on the back pocket. Um, uh, according to this, it's a high rise skinny and it's a 30 tall. Um, but yeah, very nice looking jean. It's got the M on the back there. Hope you can see all that. And it's got a button front. Very excited about Madewell jeans. This is an Ali Tahari jean. So far, so good. Um, I'm not seeing a size. Oh, here, here's another tag. Let's see. Yeah, it's a size four. That's very nice. There's the tag for that. Um, but yeah, size four. And it looks like it's a, oh, I like that. I like how it's like a flare almost. That's nice. And it's got some kind of stitch detail on the side. Flare is pretty good. All right, this is a BKE Denim, a Stella, size 26. Haven't heard of BKE Denim, actually. Haven't sold any before. Um, but yeah, so definitely gonna see. It looks like a skinny jean. I'll look that up. Never know. Once again, I provide comps in front of everything that I find that is sellable. Um, anything without comps is usually donated or kept. So this is my lucky day. This is another Madewell jean. Um, this is a perfect vintage size 32. Way too big for me, but it's got like a raw hem on it. So that's definitely in style. Um, way too big for me. <laughs> But, um, but yeah, it looks like, I don't know if that's, you know, supposed to be there or not, but you know what? It looks fashionable with it, so I might sell it as is, even if it isn't. <laughs> um, this is a Union Bay stretch jean, size 7. Um, and this is also a flare. Um, this might be Junior's, but yeah. There's that. And it's got a really wide leg here. And it's kind of like a brown color. This one might need to be cleaned. It's got something on it. I'll put it in the cleaning pile. Um, but that, that sounds interesting. And it's also got some kind of red paint. I don't know. Maybe it'll come off. We'll see. Um, this is Celebrity Pink size 5. What is Celebrity Pink? It's a gray jean. I've never heard of Celebrity Pink. Um, but it does look like a gray skinny. Um, it's got some... So I'm pulling here that I just have to cut off, make sure it doesn't, it's not internal, but these are very well worn though and very soft. So we'll have to see how those go. This is a William Rass Savoy regular rise trouser. Um, 27, I think. I have heard of that. Um, I don't know. I can't tell you how good it does because I've never had any of this before. Um, but this is a wide leg. I feel like Thread Up loves me. <laughs> um, this is a Swanee, Georgia. It could be location. Um, but this is a Swanee, Georgia. Swanee? I don't know. But anyway, it's from Georgia, the box. So I don't know if that makes a difference for quality of items or, you know, what kind of items you receive. This is just a Faded Glory size 16 jean. Um, I mean, that's just, you know, a Walmart brand. That isn't, I know that. It's not too crazy, um, but it looks like a straight leg and it looks really comfy. 
Now, a lot of these Walmart brands sell, so I definitely list them. Okay, this is a seven, um, like number seven straight jean. Um, yep, it's just a light color. I've definitely sold a seven jean before. They sell for 15 to 20 bucks, so happy about that. Really excited to get more women's jeans in my closet. Um, they're really, they don't really cost a lot to ship. Um, I don't think so. And people buy them all the time. Um, this is an Old Navy Rockstar. Definitely like Old Navy Rockstar. It's a 14 regular. I'm getting bigger size jeans. That's great. But yeah, there's that. It's just a Rockstar skinny jean. These are always comfy. Perfect bread and butter is Old Navy. I sell Old Navy all the time. Maybe for like 15 bucks. Nothing crazy, but they still sell. Okay, this is a new attack signature by Levi Strauss. Pull on skinny pant. Brand new attack. Um, okay, that's just fuzz. But yeah, there's that. I had I had kept a pair of these, and these are really comfy. I love just having just pull on pants for really quick getting dressed in the morning <laughs> and since they're skinny they go really well with like any type of top so <laughs> but yeah there's that i like new tag and levi's is a good brand there is so many in here okay this is a gap 1969 always skinny um a 27 short just a basic um skinny jean um I mean, it's got a little bit of a loose thing in the back there. Um, I don't think that will, I mean, it might lower the price a little bit, but I don't think that'll make a difference. Somebody could definitely fix that. Um, but yeah, it looks really good. These look in really good condition so far. I've only seen one with like a little bit of pulling. Okay, and this is another Gav, the same one. Like this is, it might be like a different color, like a darker color, but anyway, it's the same. 27 short by Gap 1969 and it's like the same same thing just different like a darker color so somebody donated both their pants oh man this one's either really old or really <laughs> um this is a bullhead black california trading company size one so it's a junior there's that i mean it looks like I mean, it needs to be washed or at least tried to, but it looks like it's like old vintage style, which is interesting. I don't know. I'll definitely wash it and see if it cleans up. And if not, then I guess it's probably that old, you know, the old vintage -y style where it like looks like it's been worn a whole bunch when it hasn't. All right. This is a page jean. Yay. Um, a size 28 vertigo crop jean. Okay. So anyway, this is Paige. Um, apparently Paige is a good brand. Um, and it's a crop, so I don't know how popular crops are. I know it's going into spring and summer, so maybe people are looking for a more cooler option for jeans still. I still wear crops. I like them. All right, this is a DKNY jean. Um, it's a size eight. And it looks like just a straight leg um, regular jean by DKNY. I really like that little cross belt loop in the back. But yeah, that looks in really good condition. Um, but yeah, I'm getting a lot of straight leg. That's okay. This is a... Okay, it's kind of written over. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, Pilcro and the Letter Press. I've never heard of that. Serif, as in, you know, the lettering, size 26. <laughs> I've never heard of that before. I wonder if this is good. Um, but that's what it looks like and stuff. Um, it does have some heavy pulling right there, so I'll have to, I don't know. I'm, I can sometimes sell it like that, but we'll, we'll have to see how good it does. Okay, this is a new tag era postal super skinny um 2930 distressed jean it looks like another vintage wash kind of bleachy jean interesting yeah this is really interesting um i don't know how well that will do 
but I definitely like new tag. It's a $55 pairs of jeans. So I will roll with that. I'm liking these new tag items. I don't normally get that in these kind of boxes. So this is another new tag. This is a PDNC stretch slim 34 by 30 pant. Um, I think it's a women's. Um, but yeah, so I'll have to look that up. Brand new a tag. It's an originally $72 pair of jeans. So that's promising. Love these brand new tags. Um, this is a Bermosa, Hermosa. It's gotta be, um, Hermosa. It looks like, um, and it also has like a little patch on the back. Let me see if I can find the size. Um, this is a size seven regular, so it's a juniors. It does have some pulling right there, um, but, or stretching. But other than that, it looks really nice. Um, and it does look like a straight jean. So I'll definitely take a look at everything up close. This is a Gap 1969 straight seven regular. This is a kid's um, pant. There we go. Just look, it's like really tiny and it also has these adjustable bands in there. That's usually means it's a kid's. But it does have a lot of like pen marks and stuff on it. So I might um, try to wash it, but if not, I'll just donate it. This is Mark by Mark Jacobs Standard Supply Workwear, size 27 jean. And it looks like a straight jean. Um, I don't know how well Marc Jacobs jeans do. I haven't gotten that either. <laughs> um, I definitely get a lot of different ones this time. I usually get a lot of Aeropostal and Hollister and American Eagle and stuff. And this time I'm getting like different, you know, different things. This is Prana, size 628 jean. Okay. Prana, heard of that. Um, this is a gray. It does have some stretching here. Um, depending on the cost, once again, I'm gonna do some research. Sometimes you can sell it like that. It is straight leg, um, but sometimes you can sell it like that. All right, this is an American Eagle. Super, super stretch jegging. Um, it doesn't have a size, but there we go. All right, and here is another American Eagle pant. That is a size zero sky high jegging. This one is smaller, so it probably did not have those together, but um, but there's that. And it looks okay. It does have some like, I don't know, issues here. We'll see. I'm definitely listing a lot more things with flaws, um, as long as it doesn't have a whole like in this area, <laughs> um, I will try to list it because um, that, you know, I'll, I'll actually send the stuff that I can't list that has holes um, to the donation place that I always send to that sends me a free label. The, um, I'll put the website in the description box for that. But yeah, I'm definitely listing a lot more stuff now. Like I'm not gonna sit there and, you know, um, donate stuff that people will still buy anymore. I just, I want to get every like penny, you know, out of what I get. All right. This is Sound and Style New York, Los Angeles by Bo Dawson Silk Denim Comfort Obsession Zipper Free. Um, it is a size extra large. It is really soft. Never, never heard of that before. Um, but yeah, it's like a stretchy pull on pant. So we will, we will see about that. All right, this is NYDJ, size 12. Um, it's a really dark jean, it looks nice. Um, it might need to be washed as well. Um, I see a little bit of like a spot on it. But other than that, it seems okay. All of the, that looks really nice. A lot of these look very nice. All right, this is an American Eagle Outfitters jean. Um, it's another jegging. It's a size zero, and this one is 
heavily distressed, but it's a light color. Maybe I can bundle a couple together. We'll see. That would be, never tried a bundle like that. So maybe I'll try and see if that works. Some people have tried to do that and it works. This is the Old Navy Flare Ankle High Rise. It's a size four. And that is another one of those um, raw hem kind of pants. So definitely in style. And that looks in really good condition. Love Old Navy jeans. Okay, and this is another Madewell jean. I'm just like in Madewell jean territory right now. Um, this is a high rise skinny, another 30 tall. So maybe I can lot those two together. But it's just like the other one I pulled out, except it's, you know, a darker color. This is a LC Lauren Conrad size six. Lauren Conrad's good, right? This is another skinny jean. Is that, is that six? Yeah. But there you go. That's a six. <laughs> but yeah, it has that on the back. And it looks um, really good. There's the hem there. I like it. That looks nice. All right. This is a, okay, I can deal with this. This is a Wrangler jean. Yes. Um, and this is a 29 by 30. Definitely looks like a men's. I could be completely wrong. I think they also make women's, but it looks, from the way it looks, it looks like a men's. So I'll definitely do some research. But yeah, so there's that. And it's an older kind of pair of jeans. So, you know, somebody might like the vintage feel and look of that. But yeah, I'll be, I'll probably have to wash a lot of this. <laughs> All right, this is a Perry Ellis size eight jean. Never heard of that. It looks like a kid's. Never heard of Perry Ellis. I haven't really seen that tag before, um, but it looks like a kid's jean. Um, I'll have to see if it's a boy or girl, but definitely gonna look that up. Kids clothes can do well. Okay, this is a Denizen from Levi's 285 Relaxed. Um, and it is size 36 by 32. There we go. Um, this also looks like a men's jean. I'm going to be researching that. It's just the size of the front, but there's that. And yeah, it's just really large. Um, I don't mind men, men's jeans sell for me too. So I don't mind getting those. They're just heavier. So like, you know, I'm not making the extra money you know, on them because I have to ship, but that's okay. All right, this is an Old Navy Rockstar Super Skinny. Really love these Old Navy Rockstars. It's a 14, I guess like the other one that I got. So yeah, that's nice. Um, that looks, that looks to be in good condition. Um, yeah, very nice. Dark pear. We are not done. <laughs> okay, this is a tractor, a size 10. Okay, so it looks like a size 10 as a kid's. Another kid's pair of jeans, I guess. Size 10. I've never heard of that brand before. Okay, this is an Express Jeans. This is a skinny Stella regular fit low rise size eight. And there we go. It's really weird, it's got this stretching. I'll show you. <laughs> but there's that. Um, but yeah, it's got this really weird, like, I don't know what it is. They look nice though. Other than that, like express item. Okay, these are Mavi jeans, M-A-V-I. They're called Emma Slim Boyfriend. Really like boyfriend jeans here. Um, and these are a size one, 26 by 32, I think. Size one, they look like they'll fit me. I don't know, we'll have to see. But yeah, there we go. But it says, boyfriend fit jeans are nice, comfy, loose. All right, these are 
XX1, like 21 premium denim, denim size 26. And these look like bell bottoms. That's nice. There's that. And look at these really, they are kind of worn at the bottom. So I don't know, maybe that'd be cool to somebody and somebody will buy that. I'm like hit the jackpot though. This is another Madewell jean. Um, this is a, another nine inch high rise skinny size 26. Um, so yeah, somebody's going to have a heyday with all of these Madewell high rise jeans. Hopefully I will be able to bundle or, you know, hopefully those will go for something. I can make my $50 back plus tax. <laughs> Um, these are Old Navy Rockstar Jeggings, um, size 14. These look like kids, though. They are very, I don't know if you can see, very um, worn. I might wash these and then, I don't know, I might give them to my daughter for like just play outside kind of jeans. I don't think I'll be selling that. All right, these are kind of heavy. These are 1969 Gap jeans slim 32 36 and these definitely look like men's but they're in really good condition too oh, look at that um but yeah so they've got this like detailing on the leg i and cuffed so definitely look like men's and heavy all right this is a warp and weft i feel like that is a tongue twister 27 by 28 new york city skinny um, but they're like a lilac purple. Never heard of that. <laughs> I'm gonna have to look that up. Um, but yeah, they're really cute little, you know, skinny jeans. I've never seen this color. So that's different. Um, this is an Ashley Mason. Okay, I have another one of these in my store. It's a size three, it's a junior. Um, I don't, it looks like a skinny and it's very, it says let love rule and it's very distressed. So far I have not seen any obvious holes on any of these jeans, which is making me very happy. <laughs> I was expecting like a whole bunch of like throwing away and donating and so far it's been amazing. This is Adriano Goldsmead, the Stevie ankle pant, and it is a size 29 regular. Oh, those are nice. But yeah, there's this. I don't think this goes for too much, but it's distressed. It's an ankle pant, so that might be good. I'll definitely wash those. They look like they have some kind of paint. And of course, at the very bottom are the white jeans. <laughs> but these are good. These are J. Crew white jeans. They're 30, size 30 toothpick skinny jeans I guess um, they always like to give me white at the bottom here <laughs> um, but there we go cuz they like get dirty yeah uh. okay but anyway there's that I definitely sold the last pair of J crew white jeans that I had and apparently white J crew jeans are a good deal Here's a Lauren Jean Company Ralph Lauren white pair of jeans. These are really nice. Um, they're a size six. So those are nice. Yeah. And those are not currently dirty, which, oh, maybe they are. Oh no, it's just the bottom of the box. And then we've got two more pair left. So hopefully this video isn't too long. We have a Gap Denim size eight, and that looks like another kid's pair of pants. Eight regular pair of pants, see how, it doesn't, yeah, I have the, has the side things, but there's that. I've got a lot of kid's pants in here, which is interesting. I wonder, maybe I should take it once upon a child, I don't know, which is a buy sell trade in my area. And then last but not the least, in my opinion, because I like this brand, this is a Lucky brand, but it looks like a vintage -y pant. Um, it's a size 4, 27, and it's just a straight leg, sweet straight jean. Lucky brand jean. Very nice. And it looks really good. I don't see any pulling on it or anything. I like Lucky brand. I will always look for Lucky brand. 
it has always sold well for me. So anyway, that is my whole 50 pound denim box. I am very excited about this because all these Madewell items, the Lucky brand, I mean, you name it, I haven't gotten this many good things in a box in a long time <laughs> when it comes to denim. So I, and nothing feel, feels like it's overly flawed where I can't sell it except for a couple of the kids items where I might just keep them. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Um, but like I said, I did pay $50 plus tax. I got free shipping on it. Um, but yeah, definitely a great box. I highly recommend if you sell jeans. A lot of people don't like to sell jeans because they're heavy. But yeah, anyway, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you who tune into my videos every week, every other week, whenever I have time to post. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you want to see more unboxings like this. And as always, be kind, be courageous, and be the best you. Bye. Hey, Muffin. Hi, Muffin. Where did your toy go? Here. I'm going to find it for you. Here you go. There you go. You found your toy. I love you, Muffin.